the United Kingdom will be hoping for its first Eurovision win in more than two decades next weekend. With automatic qualification for the final secured, UK entrant Siri will take to the stage in eight days in Lisbon to perform her track storm. With just two top 10 finishes in the past 21 years, Siri, whose real name is Susanna Marie Cork, will have to beat odds of 100 over 1 to take European music's biggest crown. However, radio DJ Scott Mills, who is part of the BBC's Eurovision commentating team, labeled the track the most Eurovision friendly song the United Kingdom's had in years. It's got all the ingredients of a classic Eurovision song, he added. Siri, Joel Anderson, BBC, Siri will have to beat off competition from a former X Factor runner up as Sara Alto is set to perform her track Monsters for her native Finland. The competition's semi finals will take place on Tuesday and Thursday evening before the grand final next Saturday night. Current favourite for the title is Israel at 2 over 1, according to bookies Coral while France and Norway are at 6 over 1, Coral's John Hill said it looked like the UK was facing another, leap year, adding, it looks very unlikely that we will end our 21-year. Wait for the trophy once again, the last time the UK won Eurovision was in 1997 with Katrina and the Waves Love Shine A Light, and the UK has not finished in the top 10 since 2009, with JD wins It's My Time. Last year, former X Factor star Lucy Jones helped the UK achieve its highest points haul in eight years, 111, for her performance of Never Give Up On You in Kiev, Ukraine, coming in 15th place. Eurovision Song Contest semi-finals will air on May 8 and May 10 on BBC 4 at 8pm, and the Eurovision Song Contest final will air on May 12 on BBC 1 at 8pm.